Hi guys, welcome to my channel technology in the future. Will there be a Pixel 6 XL? Yes, no, maybe we honestly don't know right now. There was just one Pixel 5 but evidence shows that there could have been a world with a Pixel 5 and Pixel 5s. Even if it is not branded as a Pixel 6 XL, we would not be surprised to see Google go back to offering two size models for the Pixel 6 series. It's also possible that the company is more comfortable sticking with just one version of its flagship offering. Still either way we are definitely keeping our ear to the ground for any new information on this front. It's become a tradition that every year brings us a new Pixel and in 2021 we are expecting Google to deliver the Pixel 6. It seems like yesterday Google was unveiling the series for the first time but somehow we are already looking ahead to the 6th generation of the phone. We still have a long way to go before we can get our hands on the Pixel 6 but that does not mean we cannot start speculating and making informed guesses as to what it will offer. From price, specs, availability and more here's everything we know so far about the Pixel 6. It's a sure bet that the Pixel 6 will be unveiled in late 2021, likely during or near October. There's been some talking about Google announce a new flagship Pixel as soon as March, but that seems incredibly unlikely right now. As for when you'll be able to actually buy the Pixel 6, that remains a bit more uncertain. Pixel phones typically go on sale a couple of weeks or so after their unveiling, but Pixel 5 sales did not begin until October 29, almost a full month after Google announced the thing. A large part of that delay likely had to do with Google trying to launch a phone in center of a pandemic. So fingers crossed the launch process is a bit smoother for the Pixel 6. Let's talk about everyone's favorite subject specs. We think the Pixel 6 will go for the same strategy as the Pixel 5, meaning it will offer very capable specs that are not definitely the highest end on offer. Given that it is a new generation of our phone, there will be a few key upgrades. The Pixel 6 will more than likely be powered by the successor to the Snapdragon 765G, which should be called the Snapdragon 775G. Details on the chip are not 100% confirmed quite yet, though it is expected to be a 6nm chip compared to the 7nm design of the 765G. In other words, there should be a nice performance and efficiency boost across the board. It would be surprising for Google to stick with a 90Hz AMOLED screen once again, though the company may finally step up to a 120Hz panel. As for the cameras, we'd love to see Google launch a Pixel with three rear cameras, including wide, ultra-wide, and telephoto sensor all-in-one phone. A 4000 mAh or higher battery is expected to along with at least 8GB of RAM and 128GB of storage. This value of flagship space is perfect for Google as it can offer high-end user experience for much less than the competition. That's it. For now, for more updates, please subscribe to our channel and also click the bell icon button. You will take care of yourself. We will meet you in the next video. Bye-bye.